What is up guys, this is Max Square, and in this tutorial, I'm gonna be showing you how to distribute an object around in a perfect circle inside of Illustrator. So it's actually pretty simple. So what you wanna do is, let me just clear this here, is grab your ellipse tool and just click and then hold down shift as you drag so it creates a perfect circle. You can center that if you would like and make it a little smaller. Once you've got your circle, you wanna grab the object that you wanna distribute. I'm just gonna create a line for this example. And you wanna horizontally align it to the center of your circle. After that, grab your rotation tool. You can just select R or just go select it in your toolbar. Go find the center of the circle and you kinda of just have to hover over it until it says center. Hold down Alt, then click. And then you'll see it gives us this little pop-up window where we can add an angle. So type in 360 divided by, and then the amount of times that you wanna duplicate the object. So it can be 30, 60, 359, whatever you want it to be. I'm gonna pick 30. And once you do that, you wanna hit copy. Then just hit Command D to duplicate it and keep doing so until you complete the circle with your object. Pro tip, if you would like to add another object that goes between these two that maybe is a little smaller, what you wanna do is copy it and then paste it in place. Maybe make it a little shorter. And then just do the same calculation that you just did, 360 divided by 30, which is 12. Then divide 12 by two, obviously it's six. So what you wanna do is select your rotation tool again, go find the center, hold down Alt, but this time just type in six and hit OK. Then go back, click the center, hold down Alt, then do 360 divided by 30, copy and then duplicate it. And you'll see that it's placing all of the objects in between our longer objects that we just positioned around our circle. That is it for this tutorial, guys. I hope you enjoyed, and I hope this helped you in some way or another. Thanks for watching, and I will see you in my next video.